I want to take the time to apologize in advance because we are about to use you. We're about to come over, have sex, not even really remember you. Not only are we going to degrade you, but we're going to slander your name, okay? And we're going to embarrass you in front of our friends. We're going to show the very pictures that you send us. We are also going to exploit you any way possible because the perception that you've given me is that you're a hoe. The way that you act, the way that you talk, the way that you carry yourself for attention is the actions and the attitude of a hoe. And so I'm going to treat you exactly like the perception that you're giving me. I don't know the fact that you're just a follower and that you're not a leader and the fact that you're really a sweet woman. You're an honest woman, but you can't seem to find a man so you feel is dressing half naked, having a few drinks at the club, being provocative, licking your lips, and sending pictures to get attention is the way to get my attention. That's what you think. But little do you know, love, is that the perception that you're giving me and men is that you're a hoe, that you're easy, that you're promiscuous, that you're somebody that has no value. So we're going to treat you exactly how the perception that you're giving us, and that's like a hoe. I also want to take the time in advance to apologize to the parents out there that are about to lose their children. We're going to kill your son tonight. We're going to rape your daughters tonight. But the reason why is because you guys haven't had the time or you haven't made time or you haven't stepped back and paid attention and grabbed a hold of your children the way that they're supposed to. So guess what? There are some men and women that are going to do some unbearable actions to somebody's child tonight okay we're gonna take one of your friends there's gonna be a family function you know the barbecue where everybody has the rest in peace t-shirts on with little jimmy's you know face on the t-shirt yeah we're gonna go ahead and send that to you in advance so that way you don't even have to buy them that way you know it's coming. In fact, we're going to give you that black dress and set it on your front door because the perception that your son, the perception that your cousin, the perception that your friend, your boyfriend, your husband, whoever these gentlemen may be is, they're having us to give the perception that they're dope boys, that they're gangsters, that they live this lifestyle when in reality they're just trying to fit in. So tonight somebody with the false perception of innocent life will be taken. It's unfortunate, but that's reality. Because again, perception is everything. Because see, the guys that's coming for them, they don't know. They really don't know that he's not a dope boy. They really don't know that he actually has a good job, but he's just kicking it in the hood and flashing his money with chains and his pants sagging. They don't know. They think that they're about to rob a dope boy and they don't have no remorse for him because of his lifestyle, because of what he do. That's their mental perception because that's the perception that this innocent man who knows no better, no one's told him any better, has given him. This child that is about to be raped, it's not their fault because no means no. But the perception that they gave off was a promiscuous perception. It was okay. Yes, come here. Yes, flirt. Yes, you can look at this. Yes, you can touch me. Yes, you can rub on this. And then when they wanted it to be no, because that's not the lifestyle that they're about. They haven't had sex yet, but the person that they with don't know that. So now he or she is outraged and they take something sensely. And the innocent victim is created because of the perception and the lifestyle that we show. And a lot of you guys don't understand, man, that your perception and that the perception that we give off is everything. I know some of y'all are mad right now because of what I just said, but it's reality, homie. You can go on any news channel tonight. Somebody's going to die somewhere because, again, an innocent life is taken because of the perception. There's so many people out there acting like something that they're not. So many of you women dressed in half ass naked. So many of you men trying to live this lifestyle, trying to prove a point, trying to get attention from these women who mean nothing. So many of you beautiful ass women out there with so many insecurities, but the perception of you being this amazing stuck up person who just has it all. But the reality is behind the scene, you cry for hours and you know what? Somebody's going to get left tonight. Somebody's marriage is going to end tonight. 
Somebody's family is going to be broken up and the child is going to run away from home tonight. Do you know why? Because all of you give the perception that everything is okay when it's really not. This man has not stood up and expressed to his woman that he's not happy. That he does not want to be there. That she's not helping him. That he's struggling. That he's going through some things. So he's sick of giving off this perception that everything is okay when it's not. Guess what? He's going to leave you tonight because you ignored the reality that exists. Your child is not happy just because you buy them everything. Okay? Your daughter is having sex and she's pregnant and she's desperate right now. She doesn't know what to do because you give the perception of your innocent child having straight A's and everything is perfect when deep down inside you know you have ignored your child. Yes, some of you do that and you're doing it right now. And some of you are going to see this video and you know that the very perception that you give off is the very reason why you, some of your family, loved ones, people around you and innocent bystanders will be victimized or they will be hurt. Or worst case scenario, they will lose their life today because of the perception that we give off. Perception is everything. Stop acting like you're happy when you're not happy and realize that you're not happy and find out what it's going to take to make you happy. It's okay to admit it. We're here for you. We love you. We care for you. We're here to empower you and to give you what someone else may not be able to give you. That's what we are here for. You do not have to be a dope boy to be popular, to get the women. You don't have to flash your money for people to know that you are successful. You don't have to sag your pants and, baby girl, please listen to me. You do not have to put yourself in a situation to where a man or a woman forces themselves on you and you lose control. It is okay. I would rather you be that nerd or that geek or that square than to be that child that so-called fits in and is taken all apart. The perception that we give is the reasoning behind a lot of things that happens to us. Because we don't know how to be who we truthfully are anymore. And a lot of us are still finding ourselves. We're afraid to be who we truthfully are. Take a step back and realize that perception is everything. And I apologize in advance for those who will take a loss today.